98 Gibson ES335 and Cherry. Let's hear it. Bridge. <laughs> This 335 has got uh, a couple issues going on. Well, just one real issue that's going on with it. And so we're gonna dig into it a little bit further and uh, go over it. Condition-wise, I gave it an eight out of 10, called it in good condition. Uh, it's got some, you know, it's got some scratches, some dings, and then um, it's got some touch-up going on about, you know, right around this spot and over here. but. We're gonna go into that a little bit further. Uh, so yeah, so let's get started. Uh, it looks like on the pit guard, you can see the typical light scratches. That's no big deal. You know, hardware is just a little bit tarnished, but that's pretty normal. And let's see. Yeah, you've just got some light scratches, which all in all would be pretty normal for a 335. Let's get into that label. You can see that in there. Yeah. Okay. Got what looks like a little bit of touch up going on right in there in that spot. And then it looks like there's a little bit of some sort of touch up going on right around here. We're gonna take a black light to this and uh, really dig into it so we can see it a little bit better in a black light. The refinish, uh, whatever it was done there, looks like it was done really, really well. So it blends really, really nicely, uh, but you, you can tell that it's there. So we'll dig into that a little bit later under the black light. Just see just kind of general wear other than that on the top. The rosewood fingerboard looks great. The frets on this are wonderful also. We'll get in there and pull those, pull those out so you can see that. Yeah. Alrighty. Headstock has some light scratches, but I mean, nothing, nothing crazy. So. See that binding, this binding looks good. Yep. All right, let's get her flipped over. All right, let's start at the headstock. Let's get in there in that serial number. Serial number's nice and clear and you can see that Made in USA stamp as well. Looks like, what do we have? This is 98. Let's see that headstock. Headstock's got some dings on it, but no cracks, nothing like that. Headstock looks really good. Yeah. You can scroll down that neck. Back of the neck, and yeah, little dings on there, but no, I mean, we're talking like pinhead sized. And then, what is that? A, yep, that looks like a ding. Right there. Fortunately, it's in a it's in a spot that you're not really gonna feel it. And ding, yep, little ding right there. That looks that looks like reflections, but that it, it definitely looks like a ding. That's reflections. Okay, let's check out the back. Got a little bit of fish, finish checking going on in the back here. Some scratches and some dings. All right. 
And overall though, the back does look pretty clean, other than just some light scratches and a few dings. Some scratches going on there. All right, well, let's get this one under a black light so we can dig a little deeper into it. There we go. All right, here we are with our uh, black light, checking out this 335. Let's get up close and check out that spot we were talking about earlier. See, so you can kind of see it's a little hard, but you can see that something's going on right there, and it even extends down into there. I'm not exactly sure what, what it is, but uh, there does appear to have been some touch-up work going on right around in that area. Yep, you can see it right there. Yep. yep. And let's check out the rest of it just to kind of get a little bit. Let's see, headstock, let's see, headstock, black lights, headstock, black lights also. Let's kind of see that where it glows green. Yep, there we go. There we go. Wow, that's much better. <laughs> let's see if we can even get that down. Yeah, that bottom spot. Right there, yep, it's hard to see, but it is there. You can see down by the bridge. That's my daughter, Olivia. Hello. She's helping us blacklight. I'm teaching her. All right, well, let's check out the back. So here is the back. Now my dad will now tell you what about, about the back. That's All righty. So here's the back of the guitar. The back looks clean. I mean, there's no, there's no breaks or anything like that. You can still see the, the serial number very easily. If there was a headstock break, you would see some kind of funkiness going on right here, but there's none of that. It looks good. Alrighty. Really good. <laughs> this is really fun. Alrighty, let's move on to the next.